Princess Blade is a 2001 Japanese Yakuza samurai movie that takes place in a near future with great stunt choreography, but after watching it a few times one suddenly kinda lose interest in the movie. Yuki is a family member of the Takami Kazuchi assassin clan, she assassinate people without questions, until one day she meet an old man Kuka, who introduce her to the place where Yuki's mother died. By heartbreaking news Yuki learn that her mother was betrayed by Yuki's clan leader and Yuki is the princess of Takami Kazuchi. She escape her clan, leave her dull world behind. There she meet a new friend Takashi, who is trying to find a cure for his sick sister, but he also turn out to work for wrong people too. This movie is very beautiful and so is the lead actress Yumiko Shaku, however as more the movie goes through till the end it change to a mediocre sword fight movie. But that doesn't mean it's a bad movie, no no, it is very intense and exiting film but not the strongest I have seen. Choreography is well done. And it's a lot of sword and the actors and stuntmen do a great job with the choreography, but then it gets old very quickly after you see a few scenes for a while. A script idea it's brilliant. A Yakuza Samurai futuristic story is very welcome, but unfortunately they didn't pull it off in the filmmaking. A little too much battle in the forest and the futuristic setting feels too much near present time, but still the story is heart feeling specially when Yuki is to find the truth about her mother. Yumiko Shaku is very charming and likable and brings some emotion into her role and did I mention she is very cute and beautiful. All in all about her I think she is the most beautiful actress I have ever seen in a movie. The filming technique is beautifully. The setting is nice but a little bit too much in the forest and the story plot is heart beating. However some choreography and scenes feels it doesn't hold up and after watching it again I kinda sort of start to lose interest in the film, so I can only afford to give this film a 6 out of 10. Watch full movie description below.